elegance. You want to go fight a dragon and rescue a princess just so Farquaad to give you back a swamp, which you only don't have because he filled it full of freaks in the first place. Is that about all right? All right. Maybe there's a good reason donkeys shouldn't talk. I don't get it, Shrek. Why don't you just pull some of that older stuff on him? You know, throttle him, lay siege to his fortress, grind his bones to make your bread. You know the whole ogre trip. Oh, I know what. Maybe I could have decapitated an entire village and put their heads on a pike, got the knife, cut open their spleen, and drink their fluids. Does that sound good to you? Uh, no, not really, no. For your information, there's a lot more to ogres than people think. Example? Example? Okay, um, ogres are like onions. They stink? Yes. No. Oh, they make you cry? No. Oh, you leave them out in the sun, they get all brown, start sprouting little white hair. No. Layers. Onions have layers. Ogres have layers. Onions have layers. You get it. We both have layers. <sighs> oh, you both have layers. You know, not everybody likes onions. Cake! Everybody loves cakes. Cakes have layers. I don't care what everyone likes. Ogres are not like cakes. You know what else everybody likes? Parfait. Have you ever met a person you say, hey, let's get some parfait. They say, hell no, I don't like no parfait. Parfaits are delicious. No! You dense, irritating, miniature beast of burden. Ogres are like onions. End of story. Bye-bye.